Good afternoon. Welcome to the FTS bet slip on Monday the 15th of June. Sorry, it's late being busy. This football is wall to wall, isn't it? It's absolutely coming at us. Um, I hadn't noticed that Norway start tomorrow, so I've got to get that to uh, get all my files up for that. Um, so a quick one today. I've right, I've done the um, horses are on the what do you call it on Twitter. Um, Football-wise, I have got... Um, you'll like this one. Tenerife versus Malaga, over two and a half goals. That'll have people screaming for the ruse. Over two and a half goals, that lot. Uh, so Tenerife, Malaga, over two and a half goals. Drip that through the first 10 minutes. Um, it's around about the two to one mark, about 2.93 now. So you should get up matched around 3.0 if you let the game start and they don't score early. Um and I did have a second half goal. Oh, yeah, it's uh, Malmo Mialbi. Malmo Mialbi. Uh, if that game, whatever the scoreline is half time, um, provided it's not one of the any other home wins, 4 nils, 4 5 nils, um, but anything up to 3 3, whatever score that is, if there then isn't a second half goal by 70 minutes, drip playing. Um, the current scoreline or the relevant unders market. So if it's nil nil, lay under 0.5, one nil, lay under 1.5 uh, on 70 minutes. If there's not been a second half goal from Malmo Mielbi, um, any scoreline, even if it's nil nil. Um, I hope you had a good weekend. Had a fairly decent weekend. He's still sort of just fiddling about because of uh, letting the football settle down. Um, but obviously, it is coming thick and fast now. Um, but I feel quite um, very zen, I think is the word at the minute, when I'm trading. It's all um, all going quite well and and sort of stress-free. I'm not having any real, real um, you know, you can get on edge sometimes, can't you, when things aren't working or I can. It just is, um, I feel very relaxed is the word, I guess. Uh, just sitting, clicking away. I think I'm a bit more organised. I've got files and things organised better in the uh, lockdown period. Um, taking me a little bit longer, but my mate Chrissy is solving some of that for me. Um, but, um, yeah, when that's done, um, yeah, I'm very positive about things going forward. I think um, I think can have a really good 12 months, um, provided the football sort of stays relatively close to the mean sort of thing and we don't see a massive difference with this no crowds um and of course premier league back on wednesday isn't it man city arsenal the first game and then the old mighty spuds on friday night the old jose's boys jose's been working his master plans in this lockdown we got all our players back we're going to give the old United a right good pasting. We're going to beat one United this week and another United next week. A couple of big pastings coming up. Um, but yeah, no, going back to that, I think I do definitely think the less is more. Less is, you know, even with me, I, I have loads of sheets and files, but when you clear your brain a bit and get into a bit of less is more, um, I think a lot of you are finding that approach a bit better. Um and I, we are in a crazy period at the minute with football. I mean, you're seeing Bale Phil play tonight. I actually think they've got a bit of value, but they only played on Saturday. Dresden are on about their fourth game in a week. Um, so it is difficult. But um, when we get through this period, we will get into some training and stuff like that. It's, it's pointless doing it at the minute until we know what's next season starting and um, I can plan all that out. Um, but I will tomorrow morning after I've done Ultimate um, open it up to people to the end of this season that I know there's a few of you who want to join so I'll put that on the website tomorrow morning um, as a sort of special until until all the games have been played um, in all the Ultimate Leagues this season that's both new leagues and the main leagues um, as they are trying to get all these finished now so I'll open that up tomorrow and I'll mention it on the podcast tomorrow before um, tomorrow night's football I don't know what um, time the football kicks off tomorrow first game uh, the first Ultimate game would be 5.30 so I'll get all that done comfortably by then Um Right, yes, and um, yeah, I'll have tales of Winston later in the week. Um, 
training. He's got to go for extra training. Um, little bugger he is, but great fun. Um, but uh, yeah, he's got to be taken back to the RSPCA for a little bit of uh, extra training. He's up to 27 kilos now. Flipping, I think he was about 18 when we got him, 17, 18. Yeah, up to 27 kilos. Flipping great lump. Um, right, have a good Monday. Uh, good luck if you're playing tonight. Um, hope that goes well for you. And I'll be back with you after I've done all the ultimate stuff and everything's done tomorrow morning. Um, so enjoy your Monday and I'll be back with you tomorrow. <laughs>